Steve, to the untrained eye, a hard afternoon's work. Yeah, listen, I think when you come here, it's, I uh, spoke to Phil Parkinson that we could wreck something. He said, fine margins, you know, I thought we started the game really well. I thought we commanded it for most of it. Um, we said to the boy, get some, have some courage and play. We didn't do that last week. Have some individual battles all over the pitch as well. And in terms of, from a sporting point of view and, and win them, we made some changes because there's a lot of saying that I've used many times in the camp is that I can either do something about last week, for example, or I do nothing. So we could in fact make more changes to the team, but we got the changes we think right for today. And um, and it's it's a great win and it's it's testament to the players we see every day. You know, last week was is gone now. Mm -hmm. We said that to them on Monday it's gone, but we just need a reaction. We need a reaction for every man, woman, boy, and girl who's travelled and watched us today. And brilliant away support, and and they'll go home real happy saying the the Stevenage Football Club they know is back. Game of few <laughs> clear cut chances for either side, but uh, the one killer chance similar to one that that we had last week of course at Maidstone but it got buried this time yeah listen it's first and foremost it's it's three or four passes and it's it's a pass of the match from Foster Kasky isn't it you know, you know I don't even think you passed much water during the last week but before or after the game but that is, that's that's a championship class pass all day and that's what that's what Jake's got and Reedy's touch and finish is, is fantastic he's done that three or four times this season come off the side and going in there and he's, he's touched by the defender and goes and scores but I think we deserved it. You know, we'd not making clear cut chances. I think we'd all the play. We'd all the play really, but they box more than we did. And then because they're, you know, they're a big side, they're a physical side that Matty's got here. And whatever them thinks, you have to then defend it and defend it properly. And we had real men today. And well, they know what I think of them anyway. As I said it on Monday, as much as I wasn't happy with the weekend, then I said I'm prepared to go to war with them anytime. You're right there. That, that defensive line they've got, they're big all well-known defensive players, aren't they? Yeah, and it's a, once again, it's a compliment to us. You know, Matty changed in terms of personnel and, and style of play today to, to combat our physicality. And he purposely went as, I think, if if you were six feet six, you got on the team sheet. You know, I think it was... And that's not a knock on him because you have to find a way to compete in a game against whatever the sides have different strengths. We changed that a little bit to combat some of the strengths that they demonstrated against Wrexham last week because that's... There's no win to the world. Wrexham's a terrific side. They'll be in League One next year, but one million percent they could have got beat here last week. They were under the cosh for long periods, and especially the first half. Mm -hmm. But that's what good teams do. And, but that's why Park is a, has been a genius since he walked in at Wrexham. And the all-important three points, and that's all you can ask for. Yeah, I was speaking to the chairman this morning, and he said the same. We we want a reaction, and you know people think it's easy being a manager, but it's not just about reaction from the playing squad. That's massively because without them you're you're nothing, and, but it's the staff behind the scenes that all week have worked really hard with the players and Paul Reynard of Elwin Pledger deserve enormous credit for the positivity we brought to the training ground all week. And you can see the reaction of some guys left out today. Some will think it's harsh if, if you're them. For us, we think we've got it right because we've got the result, but you can see the reaction that, that some of them had at the end. The, the subs were first up to applaud. Well done, Steve.